Malky, a 7-1 victory this evening. How do you reflect on that performance? Um, pleasing, pleasing for the result, pleasing for the scoreline. Um, I thought we, we showed good patience and more play throughout the game, um, especially first half when we created a lot of chances but never managed to convert. Um, second half, I think we again dominated the, goal, the, the, the game, second half, created similar chances to the first half but we managed to, to convert and put them in the back of the net. And you touch on that, they'd obviously got the opening goal early on, but then Partick Thistle did make it difficult for a spell after that. Yeah, well, uh, as, the, as this women's game, as, as the league goes on, and you know, the, the, the league's getting stronger and, and, and opposition um, are getting more affair with the way that we play and they're, they're making it difficult for us. So we must show resilience, we must show patience and we're build up and we must keep, the, as you can see, the, 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 the faith in each other and the trust in each other. Um, that we, we, you know, it's game by game. Whether we win by seven or whether we win by one doesn't matter. As long as we get three points and we, and we, we're, we you know, we're chasing, chasing those above us. And to to go on and get them goals in the second half, how pleased were you with the attitude the players showed to go and do that? Yeah, they're good. They're, they're, listen, they're, they're a great bunch of girls. They they, they have a real focus about them. Um, but I think the staff that's round about them, you know, the the sphere of influence that's round about the players just now. Um, Work tirelessly, you know the the, the right through our analysis, right our sports science, everything's all joined up, um, and it's just a real good environment to work in. It's it's an easy environment to work in given the the provision that's that's put round about us. And it was a great squad effort again as well, with, with an impact from the substitutes too. Yeah, definitely, uh, definitely getting Kayla. Really pleased for Kayla because it's been it's been a long journey for her, um, COVID and all that kind of thing added, but she's managed to score a goal tonight. Um, she's happy. She's away up the road to study now. <laughs> it just shows you. Um, but yeah, pleasing, and also for the, the the younger, the youth players. You know, um, the youth players coming on and getting that valuable experience that will no doubt help them later on in their, their careers. Hopefully, they're they're going to be the future stars for us at Rangers Football Club. And straight into another home game on Sunday against Aberdeen, and hopefully take momentum from this into that game. Yeah, we just keep it going. You know, we'll we'll now have a period of recovery again. Um, where we'll do our due diligence, the, the medical teams wrapped around about the, the, the full set of players there. They're all going to be with their plans. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll come back in we'll, and we'll plan and prepare for, for Aberdeen come Sunday.